Regional softball action in Mount Zion pitted the fourth-seeded Mount Zion Braves, the host of the regional, against the sixth-seeded MacArthur Generals. Jack Haskell, coach of MacArthur, congratulating Greg Blakey on 600 wins. And Greg Blakey probably telling Coach Haskell, haven't you won about 1,600 wins in your career? Mount Zion would come in the favorite, but MacArthur tries to get something going in the first. And Kaya Harper's first at bat, the star for the Generals. She bounces out the short. Ali Davis would field. Throw to first. Snow cone. Cameron Scunberg would pull it in. And we go to the bottom of the first. Leadoff hitter is Allie Davis. Yep, she does add a time or two. Gets into one. Right center field and gone. Round the bases. one nothing Braves. And they will try to not look back. Two hitters later with two outs. Morgan Davis would get hit by a pitch and then steal second. Then it's Madison Morgan hitting one off of Harper at third. And Morgan Davis doesn't stop. Ball doesn't leave the infield, but all the way around from second to score. And it's a 2 to nothing Mount Zion lead after the first inning. On to the second. Hannah Watts had an infield singer, and Sailor Talazak walked, and then Allie Davis again. Unload. Goes up and gets the high stuff. Cranks it out. It's five to nothing, Mount Zion. Little high fiver from Greg Blakey. Bring it in. And Allie Davis has been the do-it-all in the first two innings. And Jeff Rounds is telling the fink. Yeah, I used to hit them bombs back in the day. You know, I was little right-handed, but I I could dial them up in old Beardstown. Oh, Jeffy. Staying in the second inning. Morgan Davis would rip one up the middle, scoring Dana Kennedy, giving Mount Zion now the 6-0 lead through two. And now the nightmare third inning for MacArthur. Delaney Sarf would drop a bunt back to first baseman Alex Baltimore would shovel to the plate. That scored Watson. The catcher forgets it's not a force play. And then because I'm so bad at filming things, the throw to second ended up at the center field wall. And Sarf, along with the other two runners on base, would all score. And two hitters later, Morgan Davis. Crank it up. Third bomb of the day for Mount Zion, leaves one out to center. Mount Zion would go on to add four more runs in the inning, a nine-run crushing third inning. Mount Zion would not look back, but we do got to show you one great MacArthur highlight, one of the best. We love our senior Kaya Harper from MacArthur. In the fourth inning, assumption is with two outs, it would be her last at bat. Eventually, it was her final at bat, and Harper dials it up, leaves the yard, power it out of there, and that would be the lone run for MacArthur. Coach Jack Haskell helped bring MacArthur back into relevancy the last few years, but it was certainly Kaya Harper that was responsible for a lot of that. It would be a final. 15-1 to 1 is how it closed out. Mount Zion moves on to their own regional championship game against a very good top-seeded Springfield Sacred Heart Griffin on Saturday. They do get to host it. Game will start at 11 o'clock. Pop out and support the Braves as they try to bring home a little bit more hardware.